Hi there, I'm Alex from Hammer Missions, and in this video we'll be field testing the Mavic 3E. So as you can see there, that's our local park. We'll be testing, and here we are out in the field. So that's me just doing some last minute preparations on the aircraft, making sure everything is safe and our props are out, and we're ready to go. And place that down. Here we are. Firing the drone up, you can see there that Hammer Missions is already preloaded onto the smart controller. And we're actually doing this in the field. So we're going to plan our mission in the field. So here we go. It's our 3D mapping mission. See there, bring up the settings. Move that over a bit. Change from meters to feet because I work in I work in feet. We'll change our camera to the Mavic 3 Enterprise wide camera, which is now available on the smart controller. Change our altitude, pop that down to 68 feet. You can see our GSD at that height is 0 0.55 centimeters. Per pixel. That was a, a slip of a finger, so we'll uh, we'll change that back down. I was wearing gloves because it was very cold, so we need to put our front overlap back up. Put that back up to seventy-one. See smooth corners is on. We shall alter our flight direction. Check everything's okay. Check our go home height. It's currently set to 197 feet. Change our max altitude to 328 feet. Everything is accessible from within the controller. It's done on that. There we go. Press fly, it's uploading to the drone. As you can see in the top right corner there, that's the drone taking off, which mirrors the, uh, the video feed. So off she goes. She'll fly to that top right hand corner and start her mapping mission. Camera tilts directly down and she starts. The aircraft is very quick at mapping. There you go, there's the controller in the top right corner while she's in the field. I actually sped this process up to make the video a bit quicker. And if you tap the video feed, you can actually see a full screen image of the video. So you can check what you're mapping. So here we go. Again, this is sped up, but she is a very fast aircraft. And there we go, she's finished. See, flight mission stopped. And now she's gaining altitude to return to home. We can now take our data back to the office. So in this video, I'm not going to go through the process of how you upload your data to then process it. I'll put a link in the in the description below to a separate video for that. But here you can see these are all our uh, all our camera points where every uh, where it took photos during its mapping mission. As I said, it was very quick. We've also rendered this into 3D. As you can see there, 
That's the 3D representation of our data. You can turn cameras off and have a roll around that. There we are. We can also turn off location. So you just get your 3D map. The other thing, of course, you can do is you can use your 3D imagery for measurements. So you can either do that with the background image on or the background image off. So you have just your 3D model. You go to your ruler, select two points, press the tick. It will give you your measurement. Obviously do that for area. It will measure an area. From here, you can also share your data with a third party. So I won't show you how to do here, but I will leave a comment in the description, which will give you a link to another post where we look at how to uh, share and generate reports. So that is the Mavic 3e complete workflow. I hope you like the video. If you do, give us a like, and if you need to get in touch with us, please contact us on team at hammermissions.com. Thanks very much for watching.